We are groping in the dark of the vast universe, thinking we have uncovered its truths, then finding we still have much to learn about the rules of nature. And nature does not make things easy for us. Down at the smallest scale of existence, deep in the weird world of quantum mechanics, it seems to play by two different rules at the same time. And the deeper we probe into its mysteries, the more we are forced to ask not just how the universe works, but whether anything is real. Quantum mechanics has transformed the world. We owe most of our amazing technology to its explanations of how extremely small particles behave. But we don't really understand it. In the quantum world, nothing seems to make sense. Reality stops being real. This mystery is our greatest obstacle to unlocking the secrets of the universe. If we can solve it, we may hold the keys to creation itself. Vienna, Austria is arguably the birthplace of quantum mechanics. This is where you will find the leading quantum experimentalist in the world, Professor Anton Zeilinger. When I first heard of quantum mechanics, when I was a student, I was immediately struck by three things. First, its unbelievable mathematical beauty. Secondly, by the incredible precision to which the predictions work. And thirdly, by the fact that it doesn't make sense. Quantum mechanics describes the behavior of all the tiny particles that everything is made of. This knowledge has given us computers, nuclear power, satellites, advanced medicine, most of the great leaps forward humanity has taken in the past hundred years. But the quantum world seems to run contrary to everything we know about the laws of nature. Simply put, down where things are very, very small, the universe follows a different set of rules. Consider the phenomenon of quantum locality. When two tiny particles instantly share information across vast distances. If there were quantum dice, it would mean that if I throw one die here, it shows a certain number. The other die thrown at some distant location would show the same number. How can that be? Quantum mechanics describes it very well. Zeilinger's lab tests this instant information sharing by linking two atoms together so they both vibrate at the same speed. Then the atoms are separated by five miles. Now, when one atom is hit with a small charge, it instantly changes the vibration speed of both atoms. To prove this, Zeilinger's associates shoot a laser beam across the city at the same time they measure the atom's pulse. The result is the same. The entangled atoms change state faster than the time it takes a laser beam to cross town, faster than the speed of light. This is impossible. We know how entanglement works, but we do not know why it works. All we know is that reality down at the quantum level is not the reality we see around us. <laughs> 